Hello everyone, this is going to be a update video on all my palms that I grow in my garden. This one in front of us right now is the uh, Shamrock Humulus. This one's in recovery after the big minus eight because it grew it in a pot and the pot froze and then it spear pulled. So it's in recovery. Over here is my uh, Canary Island date palm. Got a laugh, I've just been uh, reading some um, gardening catalogues and they say this one only grows to two meters tall and it's winter hardy in the UK. If you have a big specimen of the Canary Island, let me know. I keep this one in the garage over winter just to protect it until it gets too big and then it's out for, outside to fight for itself. Sunshine outside again, so it's time to inspect my uh, Trachycarpus fortunae. This one looks in good shape. No spear pull on this one. Trunk looks in good nick. Nice uh, green fronds on this one. This one looks in bad shape. Small brown fronds. Oh, uh, the uh, um, 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 treacherous spear pull. Uh, the trunk feels all right. All right. I'll get back to you. I'll just cut it right here. I carry on now, got my wits back. Just gone and got the uh, hydrogen peroxide out the garage, which is used on the uh, Shamrock Sumerless. All I'm gonna do is just uh, pour it down the center of the crown where the spear pulls come out. And then you should actually see it fizz up, but like a bit of lemonade. I use hydrogen peroxide because it kills the fungal infection inside the palm, caused by uh, the rot from the stems. All I do, after it's uh, dried out a little bit, I put a little pot over the top of it, just to keep the inside of the crown nice and dry, and to stop any more water getting inside it. Over the next couple weeks, months, I'll be keeping an eye on this. Hopefully a new spear will uh, start to grow. Hopefully it'll come back. Moving on now to one of my uh, personal favourite palms that, gr that I grow is the Washingtonia, the Waggies. I absolutely love these ones. I'm going to leave the uh, fronds all on as they are at the moment just to help it get uh, used to the light outside of it and help, help get some uh, good old sun on the palm. I actually bought these waggies as sticks a couple, uh, what was it now, two, three years ago now, I think it was. And uh, I wasn't very happy, but my favourite word, <clears throat> I've uh, persevered. Just look at the uh, shadow on the fence there. Great, here we go. Let's try another tracky carpus. Hopefully this one's a uh, much better condition. Bigger fronds, greener fronds. It's be a... Uh, Solid, happy, different location. This one gets more sun, but this one's more on a raised bed. This one seems a lot more healthier. Oh, there's my next project doing the uh, bamboo, but just behind it, that little hole, that's where my uh, canary island date palm's gonna go. So overall, pleased. I need the waggies to be fine because they've uh, been overwintered inside the garage. Let me know about your successes and uh, failures if you've had any, just to keep you updated. There's my other little uh, two Canary Island date palms there and my new Shamrock Humulus. Ready to decide what I'm actually going to do with these. So thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you in the next one.